Yeah. Bidding tree. starts at yeah. 79. It's a tree. Do you, oh. do you have any of them set up? Do we know no, what we like? don't. No. 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 Look, they, they got one left. One left. Uh, it's $79. If I don't like it, I can just bring it back. I, I previewed it in the ad. I think I'm going to go I, for you it. You guys did such a good job. You sold them all. <laughs> you sold yeah. the last he did a good job of yeah. selling it to himself right there. <laughs> do we need the second part? Oh, before he changes mind. <laughs> <laughs> Round of applause, he bought a tree. Woo! Okay, nope. and now they're off to the next bid. They're trying to get <laughs> next thing to get rid of. They just stand in various parts of the store screaming about like how there's a great deal right it here. That did work. <laughs> there were three associates hawking the tree. Team left, Nina, team left. Plenty of room and room for four points that is. For twelve dollars, Frank, I bought the replacement plan. For the tree? Yes. So if it has, if the lights go out or something goes wrong, I can just bring it back and they give me more. That's probably a smart buy. But for three, yes. Oh, that's good. Yeah. What'd you come out for? Believe it or not, a Christmas tree. Well, you were thinking about Yeah, they're, they're, real, they're really good on sale. They're half off. <laughs> That's a little one. That's what I'm looking for. Well, I had a little one. Oh, yeah? But she said, yeah, that don't look like a Christmas tree. I said, what the hell does? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I told myself, what the hell am I doing here? I haven't done this since uh, 1960. They're all over the floor. Oh, yeah. I saw somebody. Yep. I saw somebody's blouse come off them. <laughs> And, and it wound up in the box, and I don't know what the I, I'm getting out of it. <laughs> what the hell am I doing here? We were in my father's chicken coop, sitting on perches with a, a sex education class. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> you tell me you f*** the chicken? Huh? <laughs> what? Oh, we're moving. We're moving. Right. We well, anyway, with a sex education class at a chicken coop. Oh, I see. <laughs> Functioning Amazing. locks. They're really cool. I like the big keys, like the kind that you would steal from the guard if he was sleeping. These like keys fit for a junt. These are comical keys, but they're they're very, they're like. <sighs> what would you do with them? I mean, realistically. Nothing. It's not even that expensive. It's only a $9 key. I like them that much. Yes, they go in on the wall. I just, I can't resist. I like your diner. I like your shopping cart. I like my big metal ridiculous key. <laughs> I love these keys. Let me just say, just cover me in keys. Everybody happy with your purchases, your vacuums. Your floppy disks, your Dyna play sets, your giant metal keys. My favorite thing was definitely the metal keys. Like as you reflect on the day, you're like, I'm glad I bought those keys. Yes. A massive C shape because look how where we are compared to the end of the mall. We're gonna have to explore this. I'm having more dimensional confusion. Maybe Macy's is the like length of the mall. Because we drove around the Macy's parking area, but then we kind of kept going. Should we just enter Macy's now? Yeah. Could there be two Macy's in this mall? It's down that there. Is this a three floor men's store? There are two Macy's here. There are two Macy's in the Emerald Square Mall. <laughs> One is dedicated specifically to men, I guess. Three floors of product just for men. Segregation. How do you men feel about this? <laughs> Men. Where are we in space and time? Maybe these are Martha Stewart products for men. <laughs> and, you know, mattresses for men. Yes. Right, and, and couches. And patio furniture is for men. What are you thinking of utensils? For men. men. <laughs> <Hot tumors. laughs> I'm confused again. Is this store only two floors? Oh, it's the third floor of the mall. <laughs> <laughs> I think we gotta go down to find out. This is some confusing mall. This, this appears to be another Macy's though, right? Yeah, this is a separate isolated Macy's, right? It's on the third floor, the second floor, and probably not the first floor? So oh, where's the line? What? I'm not following any arrows. Excuse me? Where do I need to go to check you out? You have to follow the blue line. And I'll follow the arrows. I'm not gonna follow you the You have to follow the blue line. Okay. Well, else they'll send you back. So, yeah. So John was told to follow the blue lines and he got pissed off and left. By the way, he's right. There's no reason to be following. This is all going to the back of the store to get to the cash register. It wraps around the entire store. Look, we're trying to get to the cash register. But it goes all the way through the fridges. All day. Maybe this is important at 1 a.m. If this is the kind of asinine you pull all of your best buy, this is why you were failed. <laughs> this is all this to get to the registers. I, I can see why John didn't want to do it. This is like a death march. Yeah, why are you still enforcing this? Sorry? Why are you still enforcing when, this? When will this end, the blue line system? Is this gonna go on for you all day? It's gonna end at the end of the day. We walked They're around the, the whole store. They, they, You go through the refrigerator. Yeah. It was insane. I wasn't gonna do that. But they probably could have saved a sale if, if they were just like pick up the line right there in appliances. Cause there, yeah. you didn't need to go yeah. all the way around. There's no the reason to go all the way around. I, I, wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna subscribe to the bullshit. I'm willing to, to get in line, but there was no line. No. 
So I'm not gonna give you my booster Swiss buy. I'm not gonna give it to you today, and you're off the buying list forever. Goodbye, Best Buy. They might have needed that at 1 a.m. Oh yes, 100. percent And really? they don't want they don't want to pull the tape up off the rug. Either that or it was some some bullshit from a corporate office that said they need to walk all the way through the store on Black Friday. Either way, it cost them a sale today. I went on Amazon. I ordered it for 13 dollars cheaper. There you go. It's it's it'll be here on Monday. <laughs> poor, Why are you recording me, sir? For fun. Card? Uh, nope. Due to the Sears My Way discount, this is going to cost zero dollars. It must be from all the money I've spent over in the auto, because I always get my car repaired at the Sears Auto, and that must go into my My Way account. And thus, this entire transaction is free. John is positively baffled. I'm still in awe that I paid zero dollars. So what happened was, long ago, you must have signed up for a MyWay account. Yeah. Then you must have spent several thousand dollars in their automotive area. And I probably signed up. 2007, and I still have $12 worth of transaction points left. As long as you're willing to spend thousands of dollars on your car and wait eight years, you can reap. I'm still in awe. I'll be in awe until next year about this deal. I'll remember it forever. The, the day I was prepared to spend $112 at Sears, and I spent zero and walked out with all the stuff. Yeah.